Welcome back to the main style. Happy Sunday. I just left church. Um, I'm about to go into Star Side Provisions. I think that's what it's called, or either Star Provisions. Um, but it's like in a how mill area, like right by Top Golf. Um, I'm about to go in here and give me a little snack. So at 1 30, I'm supposed to be going to this little brunch to celebrate. I'm in like a small group at church and we're celebrating like the girl who lead who um led our small group. Um it's supposed to be at 1 30, like I said, and right after church, but church ended way earlier than I think any of us intended to. So I have nothing to do until 1 30. I don't want to go back home um, because the girl's house is literally where we're going to do the brunch at is right by my church. My church is in this area and her house is over here. So it don't make sense to drive back home. They come back over here because um, I do need to leave out later. So I probably would have, but since I have to leave out later, I'm just about to do, I'm not about to do all that. So anyway, I decided to come here, give me a little snack, give me a little drink and just come see what the place is about. I pass it all the time. I always wonder what it is. So I'm about to do that. Um, and yeah, so I just wanted to kick the vlog off here. I'm sure I included some things in me going to church. Y'all had to park so far to go to church this morning, but on the other side of that, I'm grateful because I mean, my church is getting packed, like the, it is growing so much. And I'm just grateful that people are like coming there because that church has made a huge impact on my life and like my faith walk. Um, so it's just, it makes my heart like flutter for them. I'm excited for them and the growth that's coming. Um, and also, I haven't been to church in a few weeks, so I was happy to be there. Um, and yeah, but let's go in here. Let's go see what it's about. This is a snack. I'm going to try to vlog. Uh, I've never been here, so I don't know how it will be vlogging, but I'm going to try. But yeah, let's go get us a snack or and something to drink. I Hey y'all, so I'm back home. Now I'm about to get ready to go to this birthday dinner, but I wanted to come and chat really quick. Um, so I had so much fun at the brunch. We played this game called Spoons. We played Uno. Um, Spoons was so fun. I made it to like the fifth round, I think. I've never played that before. It was just so much fun. But you gotta be on your like toes when you're playing that. And then, what else did we play? We played Uno, but the version we played was how my, the girl Naya, how her family plays. And it's so many rules. Like, you can't tell nobody when it's their turn. And if you take too long to play, you got to draw two. It was just funny. Like, we were playing one game for at least 45 minutes. So somebody uh, call, finally called Uno out. It was funny. I really enjoyed it. Um, It was just refreshing to be around, like, a different crew of people and just... It was encouraging. Like, you know, it's a lot of young people. Just like, you know, I don't really go to stuff at my church besides like the people. Um, like when I go to squats and small group, I haven't really been to any of the events at church. Most of the time because I'm always having something to do and they have something. It just has worked out that way. But I just was encouraged from going to that because now I kind of know more people. I don't really know them, know them, but like I'll like remember their face and maybe they'll remember me and I'll be like, hey, you know what I'm saying? Um, just encouraged me to like to go to more stuff. And there's supposed to be another event coming up for church. This wasn't like an event, but this is just something we did for like our squads, um, small group. Um, but yeah, there's another event coming up. So it encouraged me to try to go if I'm available to go. And yeah, I just really, really enjoy myself. But I got to get ready to, do this go to go to this birthday dinner. I got to do my makeup really quick. I'm not going to be able to film because I literally only have an hour to get ready. Um, so I need to hurry up and do my makeup. And then I want to record a TikTok. Thankfully, I got my outfit out last night. So I already know what I want to wear. And I'm praying that, you know how you get an outfit out and it looks good, like before you get it out? Like in your head, you know what I'm saying? But then you put it on, it looks a hot mess. I'm praying I don't have nothing like that to happen. Because I'm really excited about this outfit. So since I fractured my foot, I've had to get real like creative like with the stuff I put on. Because I haven't been able to get my feet done. And then also, my feet were a little bit done. I had to wrap my toe. So I only can wear certain shoes. But my feet are a mess right now. So I'm not wearing no open toe heels or nothing. So, But I want to wear like a heel. So I'm going to wear cowboy boots. <laughs> but I got like a cowboy like sheet kind of outfit 
going so that way I could still look have on like heels but still look like chic and put together for this birthday dinner yeah so let me do my makeup after I do my makeup I'll come back and show y'all the outfit and then we'll go to dinner okay y'all I did like a super quick V I literally put on skin tint that was it I don't care and I did blush and all that type stuff but let me so what I did I already got my outfit out so now I just have to try it on um and it should look good I hope it looks good so let's film this TikTok I know y'all probably like it's literally um a sleeveless vest and biker shorts and I know you're like girl what okay let's see when I put it on if y'all get the vision let me show y'all the outfit real quick I don't know if y'all can see me but I have on this a uh, sleeveless vest I got from Shein biker shorts I think they're from I don't know bag is from H&M jewelry is from a bunch of different places uh necklace too and then I have on these like cowboy boots I'm gonna get in the mirror so y'all can see me but I tried to give cowboy chic um, I got this out last night, and I hope it's, like, given how I think it gets. <laughs> we'll see if people like it or not. I like it. So, hey. Oh, my fragrance. I'm going to do, I feel like it's in here. I'm going to do YSL Libre. I think this is an intense one. Ooh, let's see. YSL Libre. Le Parfum. I think this is an intense one, though. But, yeah. I already sprayed a little bit. You know, I'll do a little extra spray. YSL Libre is, like, one of my favorite, like, nighttime dinner, like, fragrances if that makes sense like yeah my nighttime fragrances is like for going out and stuff oh I still be great I love it okay y'all I'm gonna try to make sure my reel or tiktok I'm making looks good and then I'll get in the mirror and show y'all the fit I So I'm back home. Uh, we went to Grana for dinner. I think I told y'all that. But I'm back home now. The dinner was at 6.30. It's probably like 9-ish. Um, the dinner was cool. The food is really good. I'm actually excited to go back. One of my friends, uh, Gabby, actually goes. I think that's where she goes all the time. Um, I think she does. But anyway, my um, I went to my Neo's birthday uh, party. Alexis, love her. Um, but... Yeah, that's where she went. And she said she'd been there a few times. So she was like, ooh, I, that's where I want to go. And she was like, you're going to love this place. And I did. It kind of, it's like an Italian kind of restaurant, like the authentic kind of Italian. It was pretty, pretty good. But I want to go back because I want to go sit on the rooftop and all that stuff. And maybe go like happy hour and stuff. Um, with Deja, that would be a cool little sister date. And we could catch the happy hour too. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to go back. Our service was just horrible um because i don't know i think our waitress because she kind of knew she was getting gratuity that she just was slacking or she just was occupied with some man in there honey some white boy she was talking to um she was i mean that don't got nothing to do with it but anyways she was just occupied she was not a good waitress um but i enjoyed myself um i'm trying to think what else can I say about Grana? I really, really liked it. Like, I cannot wait to go back for my meal. I wish I had got an appetizer, but I just, I kind of wasn't, like, super hungry. So, yeah, I didn't get an appetizer, but I probably should have. But anyways, I got the carbonara pizza. It was pretty good. And I told the girl I wanted honey, um, because they have some kind of honey that they put on the pizza. But she thought I wanted pepper, so that's what she added but i didn't get the honey but i did have carbonara pizza and then i got a berry smash which was a mocktail and that was pretty good and then we had cake from nothing bunt cakes it was red velvet and i know the cake was busting because i do not eat red velvet cake and i tore that cake up it was so good I, it really was the cream cheese and it was like really moist and soft so yeah i really really enjoyed the cake yeah that was my night um i'm just about to clean my room I'm not really clean not clean clean but i just gotta like put the stuff out, put the stuff up that i took out thank i'm so happy i got my outfit out last night because my room is not super duper crazy i gotta like go put my makeup up makeup and stuff up in the bathroom tie my hair down and take my makeup off and go to bed because tomorrow is monday and i have so much work to do but i'm really excited 
um, for this week because I only have a three day work week. Um, but I'm gonna have to work really hard. Like tomorrow, I have like so many deliverables due. Well, just really only one. One I'm 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 pretty much done, and then the other one it doesn't take me so so long to do. But it's just it's just tedious and annoying, and I'm hoping I don't have no other crazy stuff so I can knock that out the park. Um, but yeah. I have a lot of deliverables to do, so probably tomorrow is going to be my busiest day, and Tuesday and Wednesday, they'll probably just, they won't be super hard, but I'm going to try to, I have to, like, prep my, well, ooh, y'all, I'm th talking about it now, I'm, go so I'm going on vacation um, this week, and so I'm only working three days, but when I come back, I have a presentation due, like, Is it two days after I come in back? Come back. So actually, Tuesday and Wednesday, I'm gonna have to work really hard too, cause I gotta start working on that, on that report. And I hate, I hate reporting, y'all. Like it depends on the reporting, but like this type of reporting, I hate. So yeah, I'm not looking forward to that. So I'm gonna have some pretty. These three work days are about to be kicking my butt, but it's okay because for the next day, I'm off and I'm in the tropics and I'm not looking at my phone, not looking at my email. Well, I'm going to look at my phone, but when it comes to work, I'm not doing nothing for work because I'm on vacation. But yeah, I'm just rambling right now. I'm about to wrap up the vlog. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I had a really good Sunday, really busy day, um, but it was good. Went to church, hung out with my squad group, small group. Um, and then I went to a birthday dinner. That's a Sunday well spent. So, yeah. I really enjoyed today. And Sundays have literally been, like, my only, like, free day. And the past few Sundays have been perfect. Um, but yeah, I'm about to close out the vlog. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And I shall see y'all next time. Bye.